I'm with the lovely Kate from Perth and look how tall Kate is. <laughs> In other words, she's really tall but I'm also <laughs> so short so we're going to have to hold this out here. So you're over here for how long? Uh, for six weeks. Okay and she's already massively into fitness. What do you do? Um, hockey does. and soccer and Amazing. then training at home. And you, you love HIIT training yeah. don't you? So um, she wanted to do like a HIIT workout so we have hit the park and we are going to show you the workout that we're going to do. I'm just going to quickly spin you around so you can see how amazing this is right behind us here there we are we've got the river Thames so we're gonna put this um, together we're gonna do the workout Kate's already done it once haven't you can, can you see tell? she's <laughs> glowing already um, and basically what we're gonna do we're gonna do several different moves which are gonna be um, compound moves that so means it's working the whole body and we are going to and this works really good if you're doing this in the garden do it with a friend or in a park we're gonna use this line of trees here so Kate is once she's done like one lot of the, the exercises she's then gonna sprint from um, you're going to run up to the fourth tree and then come back so it's just a really good way of keeping that heart rate up and keeping the intensity up so we have already warmed up if you haven't and you're going to do this workout outdoors and it is really important always make sure you've warmed up so um, we're going to get ready with our first move burpees, and we're going to go with doing five burpees so when you're ready now the key thing is with a burpees you can see here what Kate's doing she's doing it with really good form that you want to jump the feet back come up come up standing if you find that too hard you don't always have to do the jump you could simply just reach up and then step that back and then off she goes so what we're doing here she's running down to the fourth tree then she's going to turn around and sprint back that's good excellent and then the next move we're going to do so if you come to the edge of the mat you're going to reach up tall for me and now walk the hands down walk out hold it there then squeeze that leg in extend behind in and behind then just do those shoulder taps for me amazing we're gonna do five of the core okay that's good let's go three more it kind of looks easy but this one what do you think I find this is um, harder in a way than burpees in a strange way that's good and coming back excellent well done and we've got two more to go I am a bad counter so keep an eye on how many I'm making you do that's good amazing really good fantastic and let's go last one for me you're doing that really good excellent well done, leg up, knee in, leg up, and let's take that hand, well done. And now we're gonna come straight back up and sprint. So off we go, taking that down, that's good, excellent. So that's where we're doing that high intensity bit, then we're coming back, amazing, that's good. Okay, so the next one, let's stand wide over the mat, and we're gonna then do a pile squat jump. So then jump in and jump out. So we're just doing 10 of these, nine, and let's go eight. Let's go seven and take it six. Go five, that's good. And four, well done. And you just got three. Let's go two and one. And let's take that straight off again. That's really good. And now sprint that back. Okay, fantastic. So your next move, let's come straight down onto the ground for me. And we're gonna go for those star abs. So now take it 20, two, let's go three. And really important here that you keep those tummy muscles pulled in nice and tight. Always breathe out as you come up and in on the return. That's good, excellent. What number are we on? Nine. Nine, okay, and we've got eight, that's good. And let's go seven and take it up six and five. Let's go four and take that three. Let's go two and one doing really well let's come back up now so take that straight back to that sprint okay so already now we're into about three and a half minutes of this workout okay that's good so your next move for me come into that lunge and just extend one arm out in front that's it and now just go for ten nine then we'll take that to the other leg eight let's go seven and take it six really good and let's go five and then four take that three go two and one all right let's change legs okay and let's go again ten really good nine and let's go eight and go seven let's take it six and five and you just got four to go and last three that's good and let's go two and then take that one. All right, and let's take that straight up again. 
Okay, that's good. And we've just got two exercises after this one. Sprint that back, doing really well. Okay, so we're gonna come down onto the mat, onto kneeling on all fours, where we just take that knee out to the side. That's it, one, and then lift out to the side. So you're doing 20. while Kate is doing her running up and down you could just do running um, on the spot doing your high knees on there all right so let's keep that going really good amazing that's it excellent nearly done on that one so we're up so if you're not doing this outdoors just run on the spot high knees so you're keeping up with Kate that's good and now coming back keeping that going and we've got one more exercise are we ready for it we've less Left the best to the end. 20 jump squats. Okay, let's go for it. And then take that one. Amazing. Two, and let's go three. So stick with us. Four, and five, six, seven, and take that eight. Let's go nine, and ten. Last ten, let's go nine, and then eight, seven, and six. Let's take it five, let's go four, and then three, and two now, here's the hard bit, and one now, power it off, last time, last time, you can do it, you can do it, keep going, amazing, if you're at home and you're running on the spot, keep going, last little bit, and we're going to finish with a massive high five, <clears throat> high five to me, amazing, super fit girl. How did you find that? Yeah, it was really good. I really enjoyed it. Yeah, and obviously, um, as you can probably tell, Kate <laughs> is super fit and does. I mean, you just tell us the sort of training that you do at home anyway as well. Um, well, I play two sports, so I do a lot of training with that. But other than that, we've got a little home gym set up. So Fantastic. I do do a little bit of weight works, but I do a lot of Lucy works with mum. So. Yeah. And your mum's super fit. You were telling me, what does she do? She, um, she cycles and plays hockey. So we both enjoy doing super Lucy's hip family. workouts yep. and stuff. And your dad does? Cycling. Cycling. There we are. <laughs> you see? I mean, what a great thing. It's like, and obviously, you know, we were saying earlier, I bet your parents inspired you yeah. with fitness, you know, and that's what it is and you know it's kind of like we can all get fit and that workout so what was your favorite move doing that one that we just did um i think the walk down because adding all the other movements into it made it really compound and yep. difficult but mm -hmm. you know because you're working so many different muscle groups that it's really going to make a difference yeah and it looks it's funny because that one people think oh actually that looks really easy but it's not but it's not <laughs> it's it no exactly it's a lot harder than it looks and burpees, like you said a really good point, like everyone goes, I hate burpees, but you know what? Burpees are one of the best exercises because you're working so many muscle groups. Just let's think, how many are we working? We work the arms, the legs, abs, shoulders, yeah, everywhere. And the most important muscle of all we're working is the heart. So um, we hope you had fun doing that workout and definitely do it with Kate. The great thing is what you could do is you could take this video and go out to the park with a girlfriend, your mom, your dad, whatever. You can take turns training each other doing that. You could find a couple of markers if there aren't trees and use like water bottles. And if you're doing this at home, you could do it and simply just do it where, where Kate is doing her sprints. You, as I said, literally, you can just run on the spot or just jog or march on the spot because um, it only took do you know how long do you reckon that took one round oh, maybe like eight or nine minutes See, it's really deceiving it's actually only five five minutes oh, wow. you know but <laughs> that's where time doesn't matter and so many people think you, you know you have to do these long workouts you don't as long as you are feeling challenged which um, I would definitely yes. say even though she wasn't struggling, you definitely kind yeah. of like the challenge. So we are gonna do some cool down stretches now, and then I think we should go and find somewhere nice in London to have a smoothie. Yeah, that sounds, sounds good. it's all about nutrition as well. <laughs> so there we are. So um, give us a thumbs up, and um, yeah, I hope you like this video, and well done to Kate for taking part in it. Brilliant, Thanks, Lucy. Good sport, <laughs> there we are. Perfect, see you guys later, bye. Out, and we are now in Pret, and I am having, I'm really excited to try this. This 
is a dairy free. It is almond, banana, and cashew. Um, what are you having? What's um, I've got a vitamin volcano, which has apple juice, banana, blackberries, strawberries, boysenberries, and raspberries. Wow. And also, and I love this idea, mango and lime. How lovely is that? So we are going to do the taste test now. I'm going to put this down, and then we'll come back to you and let you know how tasty <laughs> these are. So how lucky are we? The manager just came over, and he saw how much we were enjoying all our like smoothies and he's given us these ones so what are they what did he so give us? we've got the mina green which has got apple romaine lettuce cucumber spinach celery basil and lime juice wow, okay and then he's also given us a little ginger shot which is apple and ginger and apparently it's really good for if you're sick so you've had a bit of a cold. I have you? had a bit of a cold. So I think you have to have the ginger shot. Yeah, so we'll ginger see how it goes. Yours, and then we can. Uh, we're now going to test these. We're going to try these. Um, okay. So here goes. This is. Mm. That's actually really nice. It's really nice. Really, really nice. Now, what is it that I can really taste in that? I think it's the lime juice. Yeah. You can't really taste the lettuce, and it's the apple. Yeah, that apple is and the delicious. lime, which is That good. is so nice. You see, to me, I don't understand now why people would really want to drink like a fizzy drink. To me, that is this just is more delicious. delicious. Yeah. You know, it's amazing for your skin. You know, it's good for you. You know, you recognise every single one of those ingredients. So I reckon if we spend the whole day here, do you think we just get loads? Yeah, maybe we just keep bringing us all the I other flavours. Any chocolate? <laughs> I don't think we'll get chocolate though.